Gamers, I'm gaming on Pokemon Sword. Welcome back. We are just about to take on the gym leader, Nessa. As you can see, this giant water stadium. Got a Wingull flying above, and we have all these robots just walking around. They're mentioning the lighthouse, so I think there's gonna be some sort of shitty side plot. Oh, this hat? Yes, it looks like the Nintendo 64 logo, but it is an M for Max Mofo. It's very high quality, and on the back, it says Massive Legend. And for a limited time only, you can get this product and all these other gorgeous merchandise Max Mofo items for 25% off. Just go to shirtswithaz.cool and navigate to the Max Mofo section, select anything you want, and then use code MOFRIDAY. That's Mo Friday for 25% off store wide. You can buy everything on the website for 25% off with code Mo Friday. I know it's not a Friday, it's for the full week. I have brain damage, and you can too. To make it all easier, you can just go to the link at the top of the description below. It should auto apply the code. Now, let us continue on with these two X speeds. Whooper! Three whoopers. Imagine, why did they make Garso? It's hard to tell if a whooper is a female or male. Yeah, you just check it. And slash or. Can I. What? Can you? Can I do it for you? Well, she's this nervous. She's caught three whoopers and she doesn't. She doesn't know if they're male or female. And she wants me to open up its frog. I, okay, so you censor that. Okay! I feel like we should start off straight away by trying to go battle Nessa and not pitting around with all these. And okay, I'll talk to one or two NPCs. Shut up! Useless information! Okay, I'll have one little look down. I'll have a little wander down the road, boys. Let's go check out the dock. Oh, we can go fishing. That looks like a big one. All right, let's see. Ma Ooh, Chin Chow, I think. Yes, go Pokeball. Puff Puff, thanks. <gasps> no! No! I skipped its Pokedex entry! No! <sighs> Whatever. This one's getting called Demo. I'm gonna drop him off at the train station. All right, one more. I'll have I'll have a check of one more. What? Sharpedo? <gasps> no, it's one of the new ones. It's the younger one. We got uh, one of those in a mystery trade at the very start of the game from uh, some random Chinese guy or something. And it did not look as friendly. The other one might have been a little higher level. I don't think I ever ch even checked. Oh, perfect! Absolutely perfect. I'm gonna just use a. I'm gonna use a. I got one friend bowl. I'm gonna use it because he looks so friendly and cute. Look at him. I want to be friends with him. He looks so polite. Come on, little fella. Man, the ball looks so cool. I gotta catch one of my actual uh, party Pokemon in a ball like that. I think I got one in a Premier Ball. I think Borg maybe. There. Speaking of Borg, level 22. Aracuda. Aracuda. I like the little um swirly thing on his cheek. The Rush Pokemon. If it sees any movement around it, this Pokemon charges for it straight away, leading with its sharply pointed jaw. It's very proud of that jaw. Yes, he looks very proud. He also looks like he doesn't have a whole lot of brain cells, but he looks fast. I'm just gonna call this one Fishy. I think I might already have one called Fishy. All right, this one's getting called Fishy Fish. Was not expecting a, a new Pokemon. Okay, Nessa, wait, what's down here? You guys got anything to say? Yes, so much b more bullshit uh. about Ness's lighthouse. Awesome, great foreshadowing for a shitty plot. I'm gonna grab this, a couple of super potions for the journey. Here's the lighthouse, and there is some Pokemon that I have not seen. This is a statue of the Pokemon that's said to have protected the lighthouse, and the lighthouse is closed. And wait, that's Nessa! Wait, what? Okay, I definitely had to come down here anyway. Electro web, that sounds like a pretty interesting move. Wait, we can teach that straight to... No, I, I can't? You serious? Tyrone can't learn that, isn't he? Okay. Hello. Nessa. That is Nessa, right? Yes. You must be a gym challenger. Oh, that's her speaking. You must be a gym challenger, right? Oh, I can see a Dynamax. Can you put some clothes on? No one in this town wears clothes. The chairman was wearing no pants. How did you know, Nessa? You're one of the ones endorsed by Leon, right? You've become something of a hot topic among the gym leaders. I have defeated the first gym leader who was a grass type user. 
Here you go, Mr. Famous. Oh, yeah. You, 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 you can talk. You're pretty, you're pretty big around here too, I heard. You got Ness's League card. Did you sign it for me? You know which ones of these gym leaders are pretentious cunts. Because they signed the League card. I wanted to keep it mint. I was going to put that in a sleeve. And hard case. Like I do on the Max Mofo Pokemon channel. Press the subscribe button. Look at the Pokemon channel. I open up cards. Okay, wait. She loves fishing. Okay. Real quick. I promise I'm going straight to the town. I just need to catch some fish. Men be fishing. fishing. Women be fishing too. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess women can fish also. Uh, she wants, she's been itching for a battle. Oh, look at her. That's all it takes. I think we just needed to speak to her at the lighthouse. And now she's going to open up the gym, maybe. And we're probably going to have to do a really shitty little game thing at the start that doesn't have anything to do with battling. Let's check her league card. Is she doing a sexy pose? Wait, is she of age? How old is Nessa? <laughs> Where's my fucking Google, bro? Hey Siri, how old is Nessa from Pokemon Sword and Shield? Okay, I found this on the web for how old is Nessa from Pokemon Sword and Shield. Check it out. Okay. Why am I fucking finding so hard to find? Surely your age is on here somewhere. How old is Chris Griffin from Family Guy? <laughs> <laughs> Nessa, how old? <laughs> Who the fuck is that? Vanessa Jenkins from the Gavin and Stacy wiki? No, no. I <laughs> found it. 22. She is 22 years old. Convenient that, isn't it, Nintendo? Although, I don't think they have any issues half-dressing their younger female characters anyway. At least not in the past. There's an out... You, you can't make this shit up! Why? What is- What? Yeah, she did sign it. They're all, they've all signed it. Except for Hop. Nobody wants his signature, obviously. Leon is casually sitting, sitting there. Very intense stare into the distance. Milo, there's not a lot going on in his head. He's literally drawn a big nut in his signature twice. Two sets of nuts. And then- And then this. She's flexible. Okay, that's enough. Let's go in. I don't feel as bad now. I feel like I say horrible shit about Pokemon characters that end up to be like 13 years old. We've got this ball guy again. I see you have a fishing rod. In that case, I've got the perfect Pokeball for you. Netballs. Lure ball. Oh, netball is bug and fish, I think. Specific ones that you reel in with your fishing rod. Okay. Nessa is strong and that's what's beautiful. Shut up, fucking virgins. Don't pretend that you, that's what, have you seen her league card? Let's do it. Oh, they make all the women here wear... She doesn't look happy about the outfit she's forced to wear. Like, actually, look! Look at her, her eyes following me around the room! Why does she look so angry? Hey there, gym challenger. Shall we start the process to get you ready for the gym mission? Yeah, okay. That's right, you'll have to change into your uniform. The changing room is located over there. Yes, thank you for the help. Hello, I'm back. 420 reporting for duty. You're in your uniform. Head on into the gym mission. Ah, oh, by the way, while you're on the gym mission, you can't use your Pokemon box link. Okay! Sorry, I was considering putting a level fucking 13 Goldeen in from my computer midway through the battle. Here we are. Oh, this is a really nice looking pipes! Mario pipes! This is awesome. Much better than the grass one. I feel like um, I'm playing a Super Mario game or something. This looks like a, a course in sunshine. And this is the guy with the weird pedophile mustache. Oh, does he announce every single one? Challenging maze. Okay, I like a little bit more thought put into this one rather than just rolling sheep onto a couple of cubes. All right, let's see. Um, sorry, I, did I heal my Pokemon? They seem good. I'm gonna start out with Nicholas on the top. Hello, stranger. What are you looking at? Those are glass eyes or it feeds back into the theory that everyone is a robot. She doesn't know how to make eye contact. All right, Tim Pole, Time Pole, go Nicholas. A tad bowl, a tad pole for breakfast. Yes, I think I will. I can't even remember what Assurance does. I say that every time. I haven't reread it. Halfway damage though. I'll take it. 
throwing mud into my fox's eyes. That's gonna be killer to get out of his fur later. Gonna go for a snarl and finish the job. Tyrone, level up. Oh, that was it. I didn't realize your eyes could get any more wide than they were. All right, where is the puzzle aspect? I press the button, the water stops there, the water goes there. I press this button, water stops there, the water goes there. Okay. There's gonna be some back treading, I'm assuming. So let's do that. Let's walk up through this way. And let's get this battle over here out of the way. Hello again, NPC. Pressing a button stops the water. Thank you so much, Krabby. Wouldn't mind a nice crab for brunch. Oh, Nicholas pretty big now. Nicholas big, crab small. Corfish. You know, Corfish looks like a retarded crabby anyway. That is the perfect Pokemon for her. Look at its widespread eyeballs and just expressionless face. I'm getting stuck in a vortex, boys. I hate how the trainer pops into frame sometimes. This game is horse shit. Okay, let's go for a nice little quick attack. Mmm. Dinner is served. Okay, Heather. Thanks, Heather. Can't go through that way. What if I press this button? Now I can go through that way. I have a gigantic brain. And then if I press this button, I then can go back this way, except now also I can go over the top as well. But there's a problem here, but I can keep going to the left and then around the corner. I will just try to remember where I've come from and we have another battle. What? You made it this far? I'm getting paid to stand around doing nothing? Finally, someone to actually battle? Are these, are the cronies at a gym on a wage? Are they being paid just to represent and do almost nothing every day? I mean, cause she does have a lot of, um, she's even got like a tattoo. I don't know if that's a tattoo, but it's an endorsement on her arm. Go Nicholas, assure assurance. Go Remoraid, bubble beam. Thanks bro, I'll brush my teeth with that. Go Nicholas, e kill the fish, good one. Ooh, Fox level up. Nicholas has got enough levels now. I think it's time to get Borg up a couple, at least to 25. I don't, again, I think he's a pretty weak. She, 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 she's a girl with a beard. That's okay. I don't want to hurt Borg's feelings. Oh, it's one of these battles. Tackle versus payday. Throw your coin. Oh, come on. Look at the damage. I will. I'm going to do it. I'll finish the battle with paydays. Two. Three. Four. Yes. Let's continue on. We have. Okay, wait. What's going on here? Where are we? I don't know if I'm even supposed to do that. I don't think I needed to do that. I really don't think I needed to do that. Wait. Um, and then we do red and then we do blue. That, what, yes. Okay, okay, I think we did do it fine. Yeah, okay. We've got a clean shot at it. We've solved the puzzle. It was about a three second puzzle, but a little more entertaining than rolling sheep. I'll give it that. Unless there's another, oh, there's, there might be another room. There might be multiple rooms, like the sheep one with all the different paddocks. Nope, this is it. Gym mission cleared. Good, I didn't want too much fluffing around. Here we go, up against Nessa, the 22 year old gym leader, who is sexy and an adult. Children are not sexy. All right, Nessa, where are ya? You gonna Dynamax a Whale Lord, a Magikarp? You got more than three Pokemon? It's very intense. Welcome, honored gym challenger. I think you already realize, but I am Nessa. She might be mentally a child, so it's sort of a gray area. I'm not going to ask for a number, but we already have her signature with her leg over her head, so, and I can't throw it away, so that, that ain't my fault. Sorry to have made you look for me, I don't doubt my humble mission's difficulty, yet you cleared it! Your mind as a Pokemon trainer must be quite refined! 
Yes, I am very intelligent. I passed the water pipe challenge. No matter what kind of plan your refined mind may be plotting, my partner and I will be sure to sink it. Oh God, she has a partner? Oh, her Pokemon, of course. All right, here we go. Is this the same battle music as before or is this Nessa's theme? Ah, she lifts her leg up when she throws it. Like that Japanese female baseball throwing gif where she puts her leg up and spins around and throws the ball. Not very practical and does nothing, but it looks cool. Ah, yes, she has three Pokemon as well, so that's a little disappointing. And she has a Goldeen. Either way, I'm going to wait until she uses Dynamax, because I don't think we need it. I'll make it a fair fight here. Just gonna go with opening Snarl, and the Goldeen is using a very useless move, because it will be dead next turn. No, it won't be, because its speed went up, and it used Swan Attack. Goodbye, fish. Bye! Well, one down. Gym leaders suck! You trash, Nessa! Not even much XP. Come on, use an exotic po- <gasps> I think it's the one. I think that's the evolved one. Aracuda? Nope, that's the polite one that's proud of its sharp jaw. Alright, you knock me down a couple of pegs there. I'm just gonna keep using Snarl. If she is she not gonna use Dynamax if I don't? Or is she gonna use it on our final Pokemon? which has surely got to be one we haven't seen. I think that's how they tend to do things. We're getting water jetted in the head though. The fox is about to go down. You ain't gonna fight against the last one. I think I will switch out when it gives me the option. Dead fish, take it to the fish market. It's gone. Tyrone, level up. Dreadnor, Dreadnor. Let's see if Coleman just gets one shot. I'm just curious. I'll Dynamax him as well so he has more HP. I think that's how it might work. All right, let's see. What Dreadnought is. Oh my god, that look. That's very intense. This thing is gonna be giant. Oh, yes, I have seen that. I did see that in the, that was one of the original leaks or whatever. I sort of, like I said, I have seen a few. That's the Trutles evolution. Does he have a third form? I don't know. He's massive though. He looks like a water version of Torterra. Okay. Ch I like the chanting music. I'm gonna go with an ancient power. She's gonna Dynamax, I knew it. Yeah, here we go, flood the stadium. She doesn't care that the taxpayers are paying for this. She just said flood the stadium, fuck it. Let the community clean it up. Holy shit, that thing is huge. There's no way trainers just don't get eaten or accidentally have their legs chewed off. That's a wild animal and now it's the size of a building. This is a little gift from us. I hope you can take it. That's barbaric. Yep, that's gonna kill me instantly. If that doesn't kill me, I'm stopping the let's play. Yep, okay, there we go. Not a very high risk bet. Sorry, Coleman. It's also starting to rain. Oh, that must have hurt him, poor guy. Uh, you reckon we can get Nicholas out? Oh no, because the... The ones that are dead aren't gonna get the good XP for a final Dynamax Pokemon now. Oh well, stunt the bars for Nicholas and that. Give Maybe it gives more XP to Borg and Tyrone. All right, Dynamax, and we're going for, they all become max darkness. Give me the maximum amount of darkness. Turn the light off. Oh, look at the size of that mustache. Oh, hear him roar. Oh, look at that snout. I'd be, I'd fuck the fish. I'd be proud if I had a snout. That gorgeous. Wait, he just gets to attack straight. Okay, never mind. A waste of a Dynamax. I think you only get one, two per match. That was pointless. Yeah, I have to use Craig. Like, there's nothing else to do. Come on, Craig. You can fight this monster. Yeah, I don't get another Dynamax, guys. I might be in trouble here. I, I think Dynamax Pokemon get to. Stay around for, there's Max Darkness. Three moves, I'm pretty sure. I may have to chuck a couple of potions on. Oh yeah, I could get some pretty good damage. Oh no, it's shrinking already. Yeah, this is child's play. Yeah, you're not causing a whole lot of dread there, Dreadnor. Let's see what Razor Shell does. Yeah, I mean, good try, I guess. It's dead. Bye-bye. I got water badge, look. Check it out, guys! I took the water badge! Is it gonna be called the water badge? I hope it is. Okay, let's see the XP on this. 
Craig with 720 XP. Gary Coleman with a big fat zero. Nicholas not benefiting at all either. All right, Nessa. Okay, she's going mad. She's going crazy. She did not expect to lose. It's a stark contrast to Milo. I may proudly be the strongest member of this gym, but I was totally fucked. Yeah, well, you threatened to drown everyone in attendance. Thank you for the nearly $4,000. How? How? How can this be? <sighs> now that I've battled you, I think I understand. Continue to have seizures on the gym floor or brain is slow. You have an incredible spirit that may even be strong enough to challenge the champion. I think it will be. I'm also endorsed by the champion. I don't, I'm not sure if you know. Can you stand up straight, Nessa? Why are you always trying to show off your legs? Look at her like doing one of these. Stand up straight. It's because women don't want to be taller than the men. And she's already looking taller than me with a slouch. And I think she's wearing heels. You and your Pokemon are indeed deserving of this gym badge. Okay, she's monstrous. I am a small child. There it is, boys. That part's going to click to the top right. And it is water. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 30. You want to challenge the fire gym leader next. That's going to be a piece of cake. I love how if you don't advance the dialogue, they're just awkwardly shaking their hands for 50 minutes. You can let go now, please. I have a hand cramp. Woo! Wet bread! My sincere congratulations for your victory. Oh, you're no longer upset. We're getting a TM as well. Whirlpool. I will not be using that. That just slows battles down to a halt. Five turns of work. Whirlpool. And I also get to put on Ness's outfit. Are they going? Is it going to go? Am I going to wear the little short shorts? The little booty shorts and the crop top? Hello, sir. I think it's about time we get an outfit change, though. I'm going to sell a couple of things, though. I don't want payday. No, can't sell it. I think he just sells Stardust. I don't think it has any other use. So we're just going to sell that for an easy 6k, boys. I'm going to sell the nuggets. I got two nuggets for a fucking sweet 10k. Big Pearl. And Star Piece, a small shard of a beautiful gem that gives off a distinctly red sparkle. It can be sold. Sell that sucker. Ah, this is in the treasures tab where I think is a good addition. It lets you know that this stuff is just to be sold, I think. I'm not sure if there's any secret uses for this. All I know is I am rich now. I'm going to sell that bread as well. 150 for the two loaves of bread. All right, sweet. All right, can I get changed in the changing room? I want to put on Ness's dirty clothes, please. Welcome to the uniform shop. Are you looking for anything in particular? Yes, I beat the gym leader and now I have the right to wear her pants, I think. Can I, how do I put on my own clothes? Do I have, no, what? That was a mistake i just bought a ghost outfit yeah fuck that i don't want that all right now i'm gonna have to buy something i kind of like this one it's sort of funky it sort of matches um tox tox purple and yellow i like the slime one as well that's sort of cool that's kind of, oh that's kind of looking fresh i feel like that's gonna glow in the dark psychic one kind of funkadelic i think i might cop the electric one though i think maybe i'll only change into that when i get into battle or whatever but I'm going to go try to swing by the clothing store and see if I can hop straight in it. Oh, hello, Olina. This is Rose's secretary, second in command or something. Rose is a man, by the way, if you haven't been keeping up. If you would like to keep up, go to the playlist. Watch the episodes in order on the playlist. Do not keep the chairman waiting, young man. Head to the seafood restaurant. Oh, great. I'll go. I'll swing by the seafood re restaurant. Sure thing. I have got Rose's card for the album as well. All right. Yep. I'll head by. Yeah, she does not look happy either. I don't think anyone here is happy with their jobs. I wonder if the gym leaders and the gym trainers have a union. You should speak to someone. I hope you also have health care or life insurance because when the gym leader is threatening to flood the building and doesn't care about the deaths of any of the attendants, I'd be looking at some something. Keep your family afloat. No pun intended. Pun intended to do with this fishing hole, though. Me going to fish and find a... Look for a fish. No, I'm not. I'm going to leave. Where is the shop? Where's the clothes? 
Hello, you know where the clothing is? Ooh, you're going to fish. Women do be fishing. Breaking the gender norms in this town. Ooh, another shiny object. What have we got here? Full heal. Sweet. Check out this house. Hello. A good fisher is also a good Pokemon trainer. That's because a fisher has to make quick judgments to adjust to change in the sea. What's your son want? Don't catch too many Pokemon. Okay. Wise guy. <laughs> you gotta catch them all. It's that or nothing. Children. I'm not allowed to be within 100 meters of you. I will now be moving on to the next house. What do we have in this house? Oh, another woman fisher! Where's all the men fishing? Where's the- you don't got a men's fishing club here? You fucking sexist pig! Not a single bite today, but I still need to polish my gear. Whatever that means. You ever just go home and start polishing your rod, boys? I mean, Pokemon are bound to bite if my gear's nice and shiny, right? Yeah, go polish your rod. Next house! What's it gonna be? More useless junk? Old woman! Alright, I think I've seen- I've, we've been this far, okay. Is there nothing else? Oh, right, we're going through the seafood restaurant. Yeah, this looks like the place. Big chef on the top. I think I recall coming by here. Haven't been inside yet, though. Hello? This is Ordino, right? Or is it a different Pokemon altogether? That looks like Galarian Ordino. I think I already said that before, but I can't remember if I confirmed it. Welcome to the seafood restaurant, to the captain's table. Yes, hello, I have a reservation with the chairman. Chairman Rose comes here incognito. Oh, that's where he takes his pants off. His legs are too sexy and known by the public. He take off, takes off his pants, he's a new man. No pants and a pair of sunglasses? Who is it? Chairman Rose comes here in incognito. Yeah, okay, hello. All right, he's fucking Sonya now. Wet bread, let's celebrate your recent victory. Hold on, I have had McCafe pop up on my screen, which I can't figure out how to uninstall. Oh, you were invited to? Yuck. Oh, you two know each other. Oh, that's great. Come now, please be seated. All right, Rose. Let's see, um, let's see how big your wallet is. What are we gonna order? Are we gonna get to see them eat Pokemon? Holbury is a seafood town. No! No! Naturally, if one is going to eat here, the obvious choice is the local cuisine. I'm, I'm very curious to find out if they're gonna eat Pokemon or regular fish. Uh, or if it's even going to be said, I realize it's going to be a bunch of talking. By the way, how is Professor Magnolia getting on? Oh, she's very old. I think she will die soon, Rose. I'm quite indebted to her, you know. She was the one who figured out how to unleash the power of wishing stars and use that power to Dynamax the Pokemon. We would never have been able to create Dynamax bands without her. Ah, she was saying that there's still so much we don't know about Dynamaxing. It's causing her some worry. Yeah, she will die of stress soon. She even made me take a power spot detector with me when I started traveling. All right, they're talking about a power spot detector. We're look, yeah, they're looking at the particles. There's some law here. That woman looks very upset at the top. She's just struggling to get through the day. Snobby bitch. Understand, Chairman. I will arrange a meeting with Miss Sonya. However, I believe it is about time we get going, Chairman. <sighs> yeah, you, have ha you haven't had a chance to serve the fish and get rid of this mystery either. I want to know! Are you eating Pokemon or animals? All right. That was a very short meeting. I don't even know what was said. Ah. <sighs> ah! <laughs> yes! Yes! Give me, give me gift! Thank you! Thank you, Sonya! Shut up! Shut up! All right, what's this chef got? Y'all open or? This just a, is this a front? I feel like this is Rose's front for tax fraud. I reckon he's cooking meth. A lot of the money is going into, into this. Bit of big tax write off. It looks like none of you guys are cooking anything. What kind of a restaurant just says welcome and makes me sit down and there's no service? Is there any secret items? I'm gonna find the chairman's pants in here somewhere? All right, I'm off. I'm going to go change into Nessa's clothes. Ah, Hop's outside, great. Just what I need after a long day, another conversation with Hop. 
In that case, we're both headed for Motorstoke and the fire gym leader. How about I share with you a little tip about that leader, Kabu? From what I heard, he's hauled up now in Gala mine number two. He was going, oh no, it's those kids that got caught in the mining accident that Elon Musk tried to help and called the guy a pedophile and is now being sued, I think, for slander. All right, see you, Hop. That, so there seriously was not much to do in this town, at least at the moment. Oh, I mean, I haven't explored. They've got a marketplace here, of course, where they... All right, this, this, this is going to bother me. You've got a fishing town, right? You'd have a fish market. You have a market. There's going to be fish here. That's going to, it's going to, the bowl is going to drop. I'm going to figure it out. Except I guess, I think there's going to be no fish. Yes, they still want to can't keep it a mystery. Are they really eating those Pokemon? Who knows? Just fucking fruit. Shut up, hippie. All right. Get a whiff of that fragrance. Yes, I am going to the clothing store with Ness's clothes. Thank you. <laughs> oh, you're selling incense. Sorry. I've got something else in my mind. How do you... What the fuck does a rock smell like? Rock incense. I'd love to come home and light up the rock incense so my place smells like a musty cave. Uh, anyway, it's a good idea to... Wait, what? Why is there sea incense and wave incense that do the exact same thing? That's very odd. Luck incense, an item to be held by Pokemon. It doubles any prize money. Yeah, I will... I will buy that. Oh, this is like a... Works like a permanent repel. If you have it at the Pokemon that's at the front of the party, you don't run into wild battles. I think I am going to get the rock incense since it boosts rock type moves or rock type Pokemon. And we're going to give it to Coleman. Wait. Yeah. Okay. There. Sweet. And luck incense. Yeah. Nicholas, you can have that. Hello. You got a Mincino? Actually, yes, I do. You can have it. I don't want it. You don't have the Pokemon. What? Oh no, I've sent it off. It's doing one of the slave missions. All right. Hello. Hello. Oh no, a child. Speaking of which, let's go check out our jobs. What's up? Ooh, Lotto, my favorite part of the game. Let's see if any of our Pokemon in our box match the Lotto numbers. Here we go. 91222. Two, two. Please. Rough luck. Fuck! Not even a bottle of milk. Ooh. Jobs. Jobs! Hey, boys, give me the items. I got one heal ball. And some XP, that's it. Yeah, these are horse shit. There's the Mincino, there it is, I told you. I knew we had one. It, he's back now, and I'm going to sell him immediately. All right, we got two heal balls from that one. We got two heal balls from that one. And we got two heal balls from that one. All right, let's send off our Pokemon to get some more trash. Go get me some balls, boys. Go get me some balls, boys. Go get me some balls, boys. Go get me some bowls, boys. All right, that's all of them. Let's continue. Where's the clothing store? For the fuck, love of fuck. I guess not every town has a clothing store. This is just some shitty local fishing hole. Oh, wait, we haven't got been down here. Yes, no, we have. Oh, yes, Look, give me the Mincino. Here, there he is. Trade it for Cottony. I feel like we've already seen a Cottony. It, probably not. They couldn't have had it in the game if we get it. Oh, yeah, its name is Rodent1253. See you later. Traded in a rat for a, essentially a leaf rat. No one wants that. Its name is Candy Floss? Gay. <laughs> he calls it, he calls it Pokemon Candy Floss. There's literal Candy Floss Pokemon in this game and you call it Cottony Candy Floss? Oh yeah, it's a, okay, it's fairy type and it's a cotton puff Pokemon. My mistake. It shoots cotton from its body to protect itself. If it gets caught up in hurricane strength winds, when does that happen? I guess in Pokemon battles, it can get sent to the other side of the earth. Okay, <laughs> what? Ah, Pokeball, a magnet, just a magnet. Tyrone, you can have the magnet. Oh, 
there is the dock down here. There's a woman fishing. Women be fishing! Two men and women. Both genders be fishing. All genders be fishing. Am I safe now? Let's go. When you see one of those giant Pokemon while fishing in the wild area, it feels like it's either catch or be caught. Yeah, I, can, I feel that one. I'm gonna grab this Pokeball. So many people littering around here. Shell Bell. You'd think you'd know better in a fishing nation, you know? And we're gonna go, ooh! It's the weird elephant Pokemon that was at the very, very start of the game. Trum! Galar mine number two is a good spot. It's full of rock solid Pokemon. All right. Um, ooh, you guys hosting the Olympic games here by chance? Okay, we're on to, uh, I've seen all of you before. Not in this game though, I will be needing to catch the Scraggy and the Shellos. I'm gonna quickly have a look at what Pokemon we got floating in the cave. This is a very beautiful atmosphere in here. Come on, bite! And then I'm gonna fly to the clothes store. I must finish my mission. Tootle, don't need you, friend. The good, uh, Nicholas is good to have, even if he doesn't have that item. Because when you get in a battle, if you do want to run, I'm pretty sure you get away all the time. That's like his ability. Okay. Fly me. Ah, it tells you what things are there. The boutique, hair salon. I'm going to fly all the way back home, pretty much. <gasps> all right. What's up? Anything changed in this small town? You guys getting many customers out here? It doesn't look like anyone's moved position. I'm going to get changed. Can I, can you just show me what they look like? Okay, you can rent, you can wear, oh my God. Those are actually Ness's shorts. I mean, I know they're not, they're, it's a replica or whatever, but they're, they look like female shorts that I can put on. That is awesome. I can, <laughs> I can make my dude so gay. I mean, I guess Leon was wearing leggings. I'm gonna wear the high, high white socks. I gotta see the top. I've got to, where is it? Is it a crop? Please tell me it's a crop top. Glasses, gloves. Oh no, you butchered it. Why'd you have to give me a male version? Look how tight you make the pants. Those are Ness's pants. Like those are Ness's shorts. Look at all the others, they're all breezy. These ones are like skin tight, but I don't get the top. Or maybe it's cause she's so tall, her stomach was showing. It wasn't even a crop top. She's just really tall and it, it fits. It fits me perfectly. It's like the glass slipper. I was made to wear it. I'm the perfect fit. Yeah, I'm gonna go out with that look as well. I'm gonna probably change pretty quickly though. Wait, no, where's my high top socks? Ah, oh, fuck it. All right, guys. Thank you so much for all watching. Make sure you do go to the Cool Shirts website for the full week. My merch is 25% off. I don't think I'm, I will be doing anything like that for a long ass time. If at any point you've wanted the merch, now is the best time to buy it. 25% off as long as you use code MO FRIDAY on checkout. You can buy anything on that website for 25% off with code MO FRIDAY.